Hello and welcome to my review of my Gerber MP400 Sport Multi-Tool. I've had this for a couple of months now and I have to say I'm really pleased with it. I bought it uh, originally, I had some specific features I wanted out of a multi-tool. Uh, one was price, this is mid-range price I guess, I bought it for £37. Uh, the second thing was weight and size. I didn't want a huge multi-tool or a tiddly one. This one is four and a half inches long and it weighs in at six, about six ounces. For me that's ideal because it's for my backpack when I'm day trekking and I can just wear it on my belt. The final thing was the features I wanted on the multi-tool. This is actually the hardest thing to find, the combination. I wanted to, I needed uh, scissors, I needed needle point pliers, serrated edge blade and screwdrivers. The reason for this is I've learnt over the years that those are the particular tools that I always seem to turn to when I need to repair things, tighten things, when again when I'm out camping, trekking, fishing, whatever, or around about the house. And this met the requirements. So, the Gerber itself. Uh, the first really nifty thing I find about it is how you can get the pliers out one-handed. You can either do this by holding these two buttons here and just pushing them in the uh, pliers just drop out. The other way of doing it, which is a bit more fancy, you can hold it and flick. I wasn't doing it very hard. Uh, so yeah, that's really good. So if you're holding something in one hand you can get the pliers out and uh, use them quite easily. To re it's not a spring load. They're not spring loaded the pliers, but that's not a problem for me. The uh, the way you can retract the pliers is again, you push these two buttons here, and simply it retracts and it locks. So there we go. Yeah, and the um, the pliers have got the needle point, the kind of regular size pliers and then you've got the wire cutters, which I haven't used yet. In terms of tools, if we start at this end, we have the blade with the half the blade is serrated and then you've got a straight edge. The serrations are good, I use them for cutting paracord and general cordage. Oh yeah, I forgot to say, every single tool uh, locks into place. There's a mechanism where it locks into place and to unlock it you simply pull back or slide back that lever and then it closes. The, uh, the next tool is the Phillips screwdriver. Again that's not too big or too small, I've used that quite a bit. And on this side the next tool is the, uh, that's the medium screwdriver. There are three screw flat headed screwdrivers, that's the medium one, and it's also the uh, bottle opener. On the other side we have the can opener, which works well, I've used it once. Then we have the smaller screwdriver, which is handy. It's not very long, the shaft of these screwdrivers isn't very long, so which kind of limits it if you have to get into something very deep. But I haven't really had that problem. Then the uh, the next tool is the, that's the larger screwdriver. And then finally we have the scissors. These are spring loaded. They're really good scissors actually. I think they're made by oh, they're Fiskar scissors, which um, a good quality. They're a good blade. I use them a lot. I can cut material and bits and bobs. So that's it with the tools. One thing I would say is there's two options when you use the tools. Let's just get the um, let's get the blade out. If you uh, have the pliers uh, out when you've got the blades or, or the tools out obviously the handle can flap around a bit. So 
So therefore, you can have the choice. You can have the, the pliers out. Or, once you've got the actual tool you want out, you can put the pliers back in, and that locks it into place. And then you can work away. Let's just put this away now. So all in all, I found this a good, robust multi-tool. The uh, pouch is nylon. It's got a belt loop, which I use, and a belt close fastening. Again, it seems pretty good quality. So that's it for my review of the Gerber MP400. Thanks for watching.